From Deaf Havana, the present is a foreign land. The more I listen to this, the more it feels like a swan song. Deaf Havana had been on the verge of breakup after rituals and the pandemic, and even getting to this finish line cost them their bassist and their drummer. They're a duo now, and even then it didn't save them from the messy, overblown mixing that's held them back and frustrated me for years. But in grappling with questions of legacy and whether it was all worth it as aging, poverty, depression, heartbreak, substance abuse, and internal conflict just ripped them apart, to say nothing of Ed Sheeran, obviously cribbing notes, they still managed to overload the album with a spray of synth-inflected, roaring guitar hooks with desperate adrenaline, where sweeping strings, horns, and pulsating glitch come back with actually better melodic balance. It's flailing, emo, full of bone-deep, weary melancholy, and might just be their best. You should hear this. Check it out.